Jai Gurudev, I am Swami Umesh Yogi from Rishikesh School of Yoga and I would like to share a story. Do not underestimate the bad person. Sometimes underestimating can be very dangerous. So this is a story about a group of robbers that they were living in desert. And the job of them is anybody they found the travelers or they attack and they robber everything how they used to live so they were listening a story from some travelers that uh, there is some kind of jannat in the special group of these people, the language Jannat means the heaven. And they say that the heaven on the earth is so prosperous, so kind people, so beautiful people, so loving culture. Everything was divine. So they thought, why we don't go and try to attack on this heaven and robber there than robbing one or two travelers a day here and there is not enough. So they become all together and they came in the direction of this heaven land all the long journey, robbing, killing, fighting, winning, finally they reach on the border of this loving, heavenly, divine culture country. And they try to attack. But the king of this Kenti was very strong, very brave, brave. And the army and the king, they fight and they defeated to all the rovers. The head of the commander of the rovers asked the excuse and sorry and run away. And the king he underestimated and he just said, okay, go away. He left him. But this robber saw that it's possible to try again. And he tried again and again get defeated and again asked excuses. And king again become kind and gave the excuse and leave. So 16 times he tried and every time he get defeated by this king and could not enter into this country of love and prosperity and heaven of the earth. He was almost disappointed, resting under a tree. very sad. At the same time what he saw was a small ant going, trying to climb to the tree, to the top from the ground. And every time see, this ant go up and fall, go up a little bit and fall, go up a little bit and fall. And 16 times he counted that this ant fell down and could not climb the tree. But seventeenth time, this ant climbed up till the branch where she used to, she wanted to go. And he said, okay, maybe this is the masses. Last time I tried like ant. And he collected all the robbers group army and attack again and finally he win 
and he got the king of the heaven and he captured the love of, land of the love and he ruined the culture of the knowledge and love he killed raped destroyed and he killed very cruelly to this king then the group of the robber they were thinking what is the reason what is the strength of these people how they are so powerful and they found they have practice every morning these people they meditate every morning 5 o'clock in the morning they meditate they do yoga they do good practice and they rise the consciousness they rise the knowledge and they are very strong from the will from the soul well they made the plan that we are going to make a plan that every morning five o'clock when is the time for the people of the loving country this divine culture people to worship and, and meditate and grow their consciousness and knowledge. We will start a loudspeaker and we will make so much noise that no one can meditate. And we will destroy the culture. So every city, every small town, they met a kind of center where every day five o'clock in the morning and then five times in the day they start to say hello ho, hello ho, hello ho. and all the time they disturb sometimes these people ask the question why you do this so, so much noise no no this we are practicing our religion because we have this is our culture and we worshiping God and they know if we say that because these people believe in the God, these people respect all the culture, they will be shut up. And like this, they manage to destroy the whole tradition, whole culture in 800 years. They ruled, they robbed, they raped the land of the heaven and the people of this culture of love. My friend, this story teaches us. This is a historical story. This teaches us sometime to be kind on the wrong person, sometime underestimate to the wrong person can be a very big mistake. If you like my story, please follow me. I will come back with another story, another thing. Take good.